I'm so nervous because you can hear me. I thought so. I'm so, like it's rolling and I'm like. Uh, no, it's fine. <laughs> I just need to forget that you're there. <laughs> Hi, I'm Brooke and this is The Tray. Today I have brand new Dior. Um, I will link what I can if I can below. Um, I'm so excited. These are first impressions. I haven't tried any of these on before, but I'm really excited just from peeping at them. Um, first and foremost, we have a small Stella. I'm so excited. Well, look, I'm not excited because I like the large one, but... This is the Stellar Extra Small. Um, this is the gold with the grey lens. It's like a grey blue colour, really. Um, with these nose pieces, you can adjust them so they've got those in there. So you can move them out a little bit if you need them to sit down on your face. Um, look, this is not actually too small for me. Um, it's a bit of a different look, but it's still something that I could wear. If you have a smaller face, though, these are definitely the better size for you. Um, this one is the it's a gold frame um, on the inside with gold temples and then you've got a beautiful tortoiseshell finish on the front. Let's see if I can zoom in. Again, adjustable nose pieces. And there's a small one with a mirror as well. So this is like a rose gold frame with a rose gold mirror. Um, it's sort of a grey... It's more of a brown lens to look through. Um, and then you've got a full mirror on the front. So at the moment, you'll see those nose bridge, the nose pieces, sorry, are quite close together. Um, by pushing those out a little bit, they sit down a little bit nicer on my face. I do have the original Stella here to compare them to, just so you can get an idea of the size difference. So this is the original Stellaire. So larger, smaller. Now I don't know if this one will come out in the gradient lens the same as that. Um, if it does, I will put some information below for you. These are just the colours that I have here with me today. Um, now this one is called... Dior Gypsy 2. Look, those nose pieces. These are brand, brand new. Haven't been tried on, so I need to adjust these as we go. I guess these are like the cat style, but a metal frame. Can't really move those anymore. I want them to sit down more on my face. But, cute shade really um, these are cool they've got like the like CD logo there this is the one I mentioned previously they're starting to do you'll see come through the belts and the bags and things like that as well um, now this is a pink to clear lens um, now this lens actually fades from the inside out so normally when you see a gradient lens it's sort of darker at the top and lighter at the bottom this one's actually darker um, through the middle and then lighter on the outsides it does sort of make the frame look a little bit more narrow I guess um, when it's on but if you like a lighter lens that is really nice this is the big brother of that one so this is called Dior Gypsy 1, so this is a little bit bigger. I know these nose pieces are going to be too close for me, so I'm pushing them out straight away. Oh. Wow. They're so cool. I love that everything is starting to go a little bit bigger. This is a beautiful cat's eye shape. Um, same with this one too. I didn't mention that. It's got a beautiful detailing through the front of the lens um, and then the CD logo there. This is a similar one where it is darker um, in the middle and a little bit lighter on the outside but I don't mind that. Um, it's not as obvious in this one as it is in this one. Now this is the gold frame with the sort of the grey blue lens again. I'm just going to adjust the nose pieces. 
So this is a bit darker. And I think this one's my favourite. So this is the gold frame, or a rose gold frame with a straight um, green lens. Green lens is fairly similar to the blue. Um, it will just enhance the colours a little bit more. I don't know if I like those better or these. I am partial to a gradient lens. This shape though. Now this one we saw in the last video, um, this style is the So Stellaire 4, um, just the, I'm not sure if I, don't remember if I had the pink colourway on. Now this colourway does come in the square version of these and it is by far my favourite. These are really lightweight, really comfortable to wear um, and they're also in a tortoise with the blue lens. These aren't sunglasses, but I have Dior visors. I have no idea what colour these are. I haven't opened them. Um, they're still in the box. Now, if you get your Dior visor, this is the box it comes in. You also get a beautiful Dior dust bag. So this is a grey lens, um, it's got beautiful like padding through the inside here and then you've got your beautiful dusty sort of pink Christian Dior band. This is so cool. I mean it's a pity we can't go on holidays and wear these, see how I go. I mean look. Oh. Probably do my hair a little bit different. Put that lower. Kind of feel like I need a hair tie, you know, like a half up, half down sort of. I've got hair. Hair. So that's the pink with the grey lens. Now these do have UV protection, um, which is why they are sold as part of the sunglass category, which is nice. Um, definitely still need to wear your SPF, um, but they do provide a little bit of extra protection from the sun, especially while on holidays. Oh. So they've got a beautiful, so this is again the grey peak with a beautiful grey, soft grey and white Christian Dior logo. And one more. Try not to peek. Oh, navy. So that's really, really cool. As I said, I probably do some sort of half up, half down look. With the hat on. There we go here. So you can adjust the straps on these two. They've got the little buckle there. So you just pull it a bit tighter, a bit looser, however you like. I mean. Like that's a bit cuter with a half up, half down do. You get the drift. I will show you all three colours together. All three new colors in the Dior visor that is all I have for today I will link as I said what I can below for you um, 
and if they're not out yet I will give you a date of when they are supposedly due um, I will check with the team if you have any questions about the styles please pop them in the comments below and I can get back to you on sizing um, and lenses and things like that thanks so much for watching